It is not enough to take this weapon out of the hands of the soldiers. It must be put into the hands of those who will know how to strip its military casing and adapt it to the arts of peace. Seven decades ago, this historic speech was given by US President Dwight D. Eisenhower to the United Nations about the steps needed to ensure peace in the new atomic age. I therefore make the following proposals. The governments principally involved to the extent permitted by elementary prudence to begin now and continue to make joint contributions from their stockpiles of normal uranium and fissionable materials to an international atomic energy agency. We would expect that such an agency would be set up under the aegis of the United Nations. This powerful speech, followed by the strong commitment and cooperation of the world's powers, led to the forming of the IAEA in 1957 and the international system of safeguarding. The Atoms for Peace speech, as it became known, also foresaw the key role of the IAEA in finding new ways to use the atom to promote human development. The more important responsibility of this atomic energy agency would be to devise methods whereby this fission material would be allocated to serve the peaceful pursuits of mankind. Experts would be mobilized to apply atomic energy to the needs of agriculture, medicine, and other peaceful activities. A special purpose would be to provide abundant electrical energy in the power-starved areas of the world. The highest standards of nuclear safety and security and safeguards are all important to countries and their citizens. Demonstrated commitment to these standards helps build public confidence in nuclear energy and supports continued access to the peaceful uses of nuclear science and technology. International regulatory cooperation is critical for this, such as the work of the IAEA and other international organizations to ensure overall coordination. Ever since it was founded more than six decades ago, the IAEA has been the proud operational instrument bringing atoms for peace to life. Now, more than ever, the atom must serve the needs rather than the fears of humankind. The IAEA is helping make that happen, playing its part in the noble fight against instability, climate change, hunger, disease, and inequality.